So what did I love about narrating The Life We Chose by Matt Birkbeck? Let me ask you, what is it that draws law-abiding Americans like you and me to stories about the mob? They don't like us to use that other M word. The Godfather, Sopranos, Goodfellas. Is it that we love killers? Or is it that we're attracted to stories about characters that abide by no laws except loyalty to their own family? As a touching twist on that old Italian mob family trope in the life we chose, Russell Buffalino, head of the Northeast Pennsylvania crime family, couldn't have children. And he came to love his driver, a kid named Billy D'Elia, as if he was his own son. So that by the time Russell went to jail in the early 80s, Billy was his sole proxy running the family for him until he took it over completely later on, in spite of not being full-blooded Italian. And I love this book because it came mostly straight out of the mouth of Billy D'Elia, who spoke openly with author Matt Birkbeck for months. So the skinny on what went on in the Northeast Pennsylvania mob for about 40 years, it's right here. And can anyone tell me why these guys always have voices like this? I mean, did they scream their heads off too much? I don't know, I'm too polite to ask. All I know is I got a call in the middle of the night saying, we got a narrating job for you. I'm kidding, really. Don't say I said that.